Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. <clears throat> You're just in time. <laughs> I'm about to transfer a Moses in the Cradle, Tritoscantia um, spathacea. I think that's how you say it. Uh, beautiful, beautiful plant. You can see it, put it under the light. I'll bring it close to you guys. It's really pretty. It's in the Tritoscantia family, the Wandering Dude inch plant. <clears throat> Transferring it into Leca semi-hydro. I'm just gonna use a plastic cup and I'm going to put a drain hole halfway up the cup. This way I can fill it with water, kind of tilt it to get the right level that I want. And I can always see what um, what's there as far as water is concerned. Now, the first thing I'm gonna do is make a hole with these scissors. So this is how I do it, about halfway up. This is a very cheap way to do it. Instead of getting a heating, um, like a glue gun or anything that a soldering iron, anything to, to heat a hole into it. I just use this and it works really well. And the hole gets perfectly round, as you can see. Perfectly round, right? Just one hole is all that's needed. And then I start entering in the Leca. Make sure you can see what I'm doing, yep. Okay, now I'm going to take this. This has been in water for a little while. It's got some fresh roots, so it is healthy for the most part. Some of these roots are probably going to die off, even though this has been in water for a while. Let me clean off some of these dead leaves that are wrapping around the stem. Okay, like that. And I'm going to place it in here, and I'm going to hold it. Now, I'm going to raise the plant as I add the leca because I want the roots to be just, just a little bit above the water line. Okay, like this. Got some debris in here. And now I'm going to fill this up with water. I'm going to do that off camera because you can't see it. Just one minute, guys, and I'll show you how this works, okay? So, when you fill this up, just so you guys can see, let me zoom out a little bit, hold on a second. Okay, so you can see, zoom in a little more. This is where the drainage hole is, Whoop, right there, I don't know if you can see. So when there's too much water in there, you just tilt it pour it out like that okay and there we have it plant and semi hydro this is a these used to be um, in the genus Roeo let me zoom in a little bit for you guys there you go used to be in the genus Roeo it has been moved to Tritoscantia spathacea or spathacea and um, this should do just fine these guys love water they love growing in Lekka or Lava Rock. And it's a pretty little plant, right? Let me bring this up to you guys so you can see. Look at that color. Really pretty. These grow sort of like a rosette to start. And then as they grow larger, they will start to trail. And I'm fine with either way. So you can see the water levels right below that drainage hole. I don't know if you can see it. Yeah. And that's it. That's all there is to it. So um, real easy. This is a really quick and easy way to make a planter for semi-hydro. If you want to make a quick drainage hole in a plastic cup using Leca or Lava Rock and your plants. And to uh, flush it out is real easy. You just let the water run through from your sink and it'll pour out the drain hole. And, uh, and it makes life a lot easier. Let's just put it that way. If you have any questions on this quick little video, just let me know, we will discuss. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Hit that bell if you want to be notified, and I will see you in the next video.